Good morning everyone and welcome back to our farm here today again. So today we're going to be doing a job that I've been wanting to do now for quite some time and it's only today that we're getting around to it. So we're going to be replanting and getting stuff ready again for the new year coming. So we're going to start in the pony tunnel now because it's still a bit warmer in there than it is outside. So that's the first job that we're going to get done now here today. So with the seeds got everything done now and as you can see from here we've everything cleared off and ready to get planted. So as you can see now we've all this already taken out, all the old plants are done. We've all the timbers now taken away. So the next job now is just to get this planted, throw a bit of water on it and we'll give it about two weeks, give it time to germinate and we'll see it coming back up. So that's what today's job is now is just to get this started to get planted for the new season. And then over this side, we have to take all this out now yet and go through this and do the same with this side. But as it is for now, we'll just do this side for today and we'll worry about the rest come next week. Now, so we'll just add a little bit of water now to these and give them that little light sprinkle, just enough to dampen them and for the seeds to start to germinate. So that's just what we'll do now. So for anyone looking to keep up to date on what we do here on the whole farm, hit that subscribe button down below. That'll always keep you up to date on whatever that we're up to, whatever time of season that it is. And don't forget to hit that like button. I have no idea what that does. I just hear everyone else saying it. So thanks a million guys. Now, so the reason that we have these down boards of the A-frame setup that we use off here while we're seeding is just that when you take away all the timbers on the outside, sun can get in and again, sun helps germinate and helps speed it up to where if we kept all these boards up on the both sides with the feeding board on top, it blocks the sunlight from coming in. And the reason that we use these in the first place is that we have snails that don't like the sun so that they will sleep on the inside of these boards in the dark during the day. So it does the exact same thing when you want to replant, it stops the sun from getting in because that's what they're designed to do. So we take these away and just leave them up out of the way until we replant. And once this starts to come up and starts to turn green, then we can come back and put all these down frames all the way down again and that will be getting ready for the new season. So ahead. what today has been all about now is just cleaning off boards. So it's replanted, all that's done. We're just waiting for that now to come up. So today now it's been all about taking down boards, 
bringing them outside, power washing them, cleaning them all, and bringing them back in. So these ones now here, we've all cleaned and they're all power washed and back up on top of the feeding boards now because we've no snails really in here at the minute. So we're going to leave all these timbers now up in the feeding boards until the grass comes up. And once the grass starts to grow up, then we can come and put all these back down all the way along. So we've all these done now so far this morning. So we just have a bit more now to do to get these finished off in here and get them all up. And that'll be another job done on the farm here. So that's just what saying now has been all about. So we'll bring you out now and show you the way we clean them. We power wash them just to give them a good deep clean, which is what you need just for a new season coming up and glorious sunshine here today, this morning. So what we've been at now today is just bringing the boards out and just bring them to the panty tunnel here all the way out and then we line them up here and we power wash them all and we clean them all off. So by doing that then we'll get spanking clean brand new boards. And once that's done then we can bring them all back into the panty tunnel and just leave them up until the grass comes up and have them all ready to go once the grass comes in. Everything is ready to be put down and ready to go. So that's just what we're waiting on now at the minute. So let's go power washing. So we've been at this for hours and hours already today, so it's a slow job, but it will get there in the end. There's a lot of timbers, you have a lot more timbers than you ever think you have, but it's just a job that we have to do, just to keep everything clean and tidy, and that's what we're at now, so there we go. So just after looking at the time now there, and it's soon time for school runs and to pick up the kids, so I'm going to have to take all this stuff here now, put it over to the corner and put the timbers away because we're expecting a truck now today with a load of bird netting supplies from a factory. So that'll be arriving in today. So just in case I'm gone up to the school collecting kids when that does come, I just want this cleared off because the truckers know themselves exactly where it's going into the warehouse anyway. But I just want them to have plenty of room to turn around and reverse back in. So I'll just clear all this off just for now and we'll get it back out again once all the schoolwork and homework is done. So talk to you soon.
Now, so we've just finished power washing now here. So all the boards are done, finally. So you'll be able to see everything now there. So we'll just go now and put these back in the panny tunnel and that'll be another job then done with getting that 2021 season ready. So everything is up now and in its place. So we're just waiting now on the green veg to grow. And once that grows then everything is already here and ready to be put straight back down. All cleared off and cleaned. So once we start getting green coming up here now, all these boards can go straight down. Everything is just ready to, ready to go. And that's the way we like it to have it this year. So that we're not waiting on anything and everything is done before we need it. So everything is cleaned and ready to go. So it's just to make it easier for us when the time comes to put them down, that we're not going looking to clean them then, because then that will add on to more time. So by doing it this way, while the grass or the green veg is growing, timber is ready, everything goes down together then once it starts coming up. So that's what, that's we're, what doing. we're doing. We have that small bit now planted indoors and we'll come back in two weeks now and we'll have a look and see how far it has gotten and how green it gets. So the next stage now is to go up the field and to clear off all the old veg that was in it and get the soil ready for replanting now for this spring coming. And then after that, we'll come back and we'll clear off this pin here behind me and we'll get that replanted. So we'll keep you up to date and we'll come back in a few weeks and we'll have a look and see how far we've gotten. So we're going to wrap up this video now here because we can't do anything else now until the green is fully up. So everyone that has watched it all the way to now, Thanks a million to everyone around the world. And if you've got this far, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and give us a like. And that way you get to keep up to date on everything that we're doing here on the farm. And once this is green and everything is back up, we'll be come back in with the camera and we'll show you putting all the timbers back down and putting snails onto their new beds. So thanks a million everyone and we'll talk to you again soon.